And now, from Fox 55 News, this is your local sports. Hey, good evening, everyone. Well, despite starting the season just two and three, the Snyder girls basketball team has found themselves making a deep playoff push. The Panthers are making their eighth semi-state appearance in program history, and this weekend they kick off round one with a little bit of a familiar foe. Snyder set to take on Fishers for their second meeting of the year. This time, though, winner gets a spot in the 4A North semi-state championship game. Panthers won the first battle 74-63 all the way back in November, and if they want that same result, they know exactly what it's going to take. They're aggressive defensively, so we want to make sure we're taking care of the basketball in a half-court situation. And then we're going to make sure that we're valuing each possession uh, coming down to semi-state. Uh, it's really important that you, you value each possession with the basketball. We're really focused on just boxing out and um, just being in help side and just being careful with uh, how we guard people and just our fouls and just being aware of everything. You know, just staying focused and staying locked in, um, you know, not letting anything distract us outside of basketball. Um, working hard and trusting the process, really, uh, the good practices, that's that's really what's been helping us. The girls have trusted the process the whole season, and the product of their work is showing up on the court. Uh, it's definitely going to be a tough stretch, especially with our semi-state, you know, looking at Lake Central, South Bend, and Fisher. So um, it's one of those things you've got to be focused, you got to come ready to play and put the work in ahead of time. The Panthers and the Tigers take center stage at Huntington North on Saturday at 10 a.m. Winner plays either South Bend, Washington or Lake Central for the semi-state title that night at 8 p.m.